This 67-year-old female patient was admitted with suspicion of end of termitis. She was operated with a complicated cataract surgery, then had a pseudophagia macular edema, was injected with orsodex, and then the situation appeared. The diagnosis is the migration of the orsodex implant into the interior chamber. Remember that an RS claw lens is implanted and that, the, and that the lens capsule is not present. There is no lens capsule in this eye. The next step is the removal of the implant. I'm using a 23 gauge intravitreal forceps. The implant breaks easily. into pieces observe that the cornea is very edematous very swollen and the anamnesis was that one week after injection the visual acuity successively reduced and at admission was 0.05 so she had a drastic loss of visual acuity but in ultrasound the posterior chamber showed no signs of anophthalmitis So I'm pulling and pushing the implant through the paracentesis at 9 o'clock. Now I'm again pushing the implant with the intervitreal scissors from 3 o'clock. And now the implant is completely removed from the interior chamber. The last remnants can be removed with BSS. Observe again the corneal edema. Thank you very much.